John, those chords still sound good, but I feel like we've heard this before, haven't we? I thought you were going to help us doing something else in part five of turning four chords into song sections. Well, I'm glad you bring that up because, yes, indeed, we have another device that can help make the song more interesting if you have chords that just keep cycling around and around. Okay. I didn't get a clue, though. What is it? Oh, you want me to divulge it. Well, um, basically, if you have four chords that's working in a song, mm -hmm. why can't you take those chords then and play them if in a different order? Because if you do that, it's still going to sound like it's coming from the same place. The only thing that may happen is you might have to alter your melody a bit, but um, if you're stuck in that repetition and you want to get out of it, maybe just try reversing them and see what happens. And so what I'll do here is I'll do the demonstration, I'll flip it around at one point, and you'll be able to hear what happens when you do that and the possibilities that, that it creates. So we're going to take the same four chords you've been using all the way along the series, but now you're just going to flip the order. I'm just going to flip them around. Okay, what's it going to do? Here, let's hear it. Okay. Sometimes when you're writing, you get stuck in repetition. Here's the concept, you can reverse your chord omission, like Where's was man on mic? Just kidding. But changing it up can sometimes lead to new beginnings. Now we're back again, right where we began. Yeah. Okay, that is rather clever. And you're right, it's it's like you're still at the same restaurant, you're getting a different dish, but it's, I don't know what to say. Like, it's subtle, but it really works. Yeah, you know how many times we've heard this, just that. Mm -hmm. It's just got a whole different flavor to it, but really we haven't had to learn anything new. In which fact, is pretty beautiful. I will say this, sometimes I've actually played uh, chords backwards uh, without even trying to. <laughs> yeah, but have you tried to sing like a backwards record? No, that was, that was pretty good. And, uh, you know, usually you need a pedal or something for that. So that was very nicely done. <laughs> Ozzy Osbourne's proud. <laughs> well, thank you so much, John, for reversing the pattern. So mm -hmm. turning four chords into song sections, part five, we just flipped the order of the chords and got something new. That's all you have to do. Too easy, thank you. <laughs>